This video covers the IGCSE Biology Objective 2.2.3 on the 2025 CAIE syllabus to convert measurements between millimeters and micrometers. So let's talk about the calculation units. So there are these two metric units which are used for calculating magnification. If you are use, doing magnification calculations, you need to make sure that the units are the same in your calculation, otherwise you'll get a wrong answer. So um, these measurements are either in millimeters or micrometers, which are depicted here in this little illustration. So micrometers, which are typically abbreviated UM, and millimeters, which are abbreviated MM, have a unit measurement between them of 1,000. So 1,000 uh, micrometers is equal to one millimeter. So if you want to convert from millimeters to micrometers, you multiply by 1,000. If you want to convert from micrometers to millimeters, you divide by 1,000. So you just need to remember the 1,000 and the conversion for each one. All right, so here is an example. The actual diameter of the cell below is five micrometers. Measure the image and calculate the magnification. So when we measure the image and we bring it down to our ruler, the size of the image in the drawing is 77 millimeters. So if we were going to calculate magnification, magnification is the size of the image divided by the actual size. So if we set up our math problem, we've got 77 millimeters divided by five micrometers. So now we have a problem because we have two different units in our math formula and we need to convert one of them. Um, so what we'll do is we'll convert the micrometers by dividing by 1000. So five micrometers is equal to 0.005 millimeters. So now we can and use the 0.005 millimeters in place of the five micrometers and our units now are the same. So we do the, we set up our problem, we do the math and we um, can calculate the magnification to be 15,400 times magnification for the actual cell that was five micrometers in size magnified to 77 millimeters. This magnification, these magnification equations do not need to be memorized. If you remember the magnification triangle, then you will be able to input all of the bits of information to do the calculations. So remember, magnification is image divided by actual. Actual is image divided by magnification and image is actual multiplied by magnification. So if you remember the triangle and where the division bar and the multiplication bar are, then you will always be able to remember the formulas without having to memorize the formulas. So if you remember I am, then you will know the location for each of the specifics for the magnification triangle. I is image size, A is actual size, and M is magnification.